Alright, hey everyone, it's Matt from Pixelate here, and of course, welcome back to the channel. Yesterday's video blew up. I mean, I knew a lot of people would definitely be interested in, you know, seeing what the issues are, but I was not expecting that many people to also be having the issues as well. The comments in that were on fire. Most simmers having these same exact issues reported, both being the aging up or aging down issue, and of course, the unfortunate incest bug but now today we have an update we have more tweets from sim gurus and we have an official response from the sims team so they have acknowledged one of the current major issues with the latest sims 4 update and a brand new tweet posted three hours ago hey simmers we are currently investigating instances involving sims auto aging up in saves using the short or long lifespan we recommend temporarily playing in or creating new saves with the default or normal lifespan as we work towards a solution. We do know that the Sims team was aware of the issue yesterday as SimGuru Nick did retweet a thread from Krinrikt, but now an official response from the actual Sims account? That kind of shows that this is a much bigger deal than some Simmers thought it was if they need to take to their main account to kind of make an announcement on this. Normally when there are bugs, when there are issues, they normally normally fix things behind the scenes. Sometimes gurus will post things here and there saying that we know, we're aware, we're working, give us time, but an actual official tweet from the Sims team. So hopefully that means that some sort of emergency patch or Sims Delivery Express is coming hopefully within the next 48 hours and honestly, better yet, within the next 24 hours because that's when the Sims 4 High School Years Pack releases. The release day is tomorrow. There were already responses underneath of the Sims team's official tweet for this sim 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 responds could you please also investigate the fact that we are supposed to get once in fears for the previously released packs and we didn't we now have even less once than we had whims we had whims for outdoor retreat to seasons they tag sim guru george nova and ninja and do include a tweet from sim guru george from july 15th there are a long list of once in fears i don't recall all of them offhand there are some that are specific to the sims for high school years which they did confirm for the new pack, but the team did go back and add some for the previous content. I'm sure more can be added for future packs too. Well, SimGuru George actually responds to this. What you are seeing are the wants and fears created for the previous base game content. High School Years has its own set of wants and fears, which I am a little bit disappointed about. The way that he worded that tweet, he made it sound like they were going back and adding wants and fears for the packs between the Sims for base game and between high school years. Obviously, since high school years isn't out today, it comes out tomorrow. So we don't expect to be having any of those ones in fears as we played today and as we did yesterday when the patch was first released. This tweet definitely makes it seem like they added once in fears for all the other packs previously, as they said the team did go back and add some for the previous content. Now all of a sudden he's changing it up, saying the previous base game content. Content. So I don't think it's as deep as we thought guys, which is a little disappointing and I will say we should have expected this. This happens every time we get a pack or a free patch update, corners are cut, things are never as they seem, and this is just becoming a repeating trend with The Sims 4 over and over and over and over and over again. I recently watched a video from Pleasant Sims. I don't know if you guys know who Pleasant Sims is, but I absolutely love Cindy's content. One of my my favorite simmers to watch here on YouTube and even she was kind of skeptical about the once and fears in her video and I'm sure she didn't get her hopes up but this just kind of shows you why we have to go into things with the bar set pretty low. Another Twitter user Stephanie responds to SimGuru George. Will there be once and fears tied to other packs? For example Dream Home Decorator, Discover University, Cats and Dogs etc and that's exactly what most simmers mean when they say once and fears for previous content. As SimGuru George stated in one of his earlier tweets, kind of making it sound like, you know, we were going to get once and fears from previous packs, then reiterating it, making it sound like it was just for previous base game content. Well, SimGuru George responds to Stephanie as well. While creating high school years, we focused on that pack and adding previous base game content with the time that we had. Future packs and updates could add more where it makes sense. This part right here was really weird and 
I did have a little chuckle. I did have a little laugh, but the EA help bot responds to SimGuru George, the SimGuru George, a Sims developer, someone who is working on the game. This EA help bot tweets, Soul Soul, thanks for reaching out to EA help. You may have some feedback to share with our games team, and I would love to help get this scene. Please use this link to share your feedback. <laughs> <laughs> Why is an EA help bot responding to a Sims developer? I'm sorry, that is so messy. <laughs> Actually, correction, I don't even know if this is even a bot as there's a name signature at the end of this tweet, so I think this is actually a real person that sent this. Yikes. All right, let's move on. Simmers do bring up the other glitch for the incest in The Sims 4. Of course, the Sims team has not addressed this yet, and I would have hoped that they would, considering how many Simmers are actually experiencing it. The King says, are you also going to fix Sims getting romantic wants towards family members? And Syl replies, y'all should also investigate why the wants aren't identifying siblings. My Sim should not want to date his brother. This tweet having nearly a thousand likes in just three hours. Hopefully we hear back about this situation soon, but in terms of the aging up and aging down, the fix right now is to just disable lifespans all together before you load up any save files and please before any of this for the love of God back up your saves back up your mods back up all the stuff because this patch was a messy one I love you thanks for watching if there are any more tweets or updates I will be back as soon as possible thanks for watching and happy simming this video was brought to you by my supporters on patreon thank you guys so so much for your support if you'd like to join my community over there a link is below thank you for watching Thank <laughs> you.